All right, guys, welcome back. Uh, there was no fire. Really stupid. Anyways, where were we? I believe it was the party's turn to make some actions. I, uh... You think that also, hold on. 10 plus a 6, 16. Can I just say that that's the best cliffhanger we've ever done on YouTube, by the way? Yeah. The fire alarm is going off, and we're just like... We yeah, had a real-life war horn. Do what? Yeah. We had a real-life war horn. Yeah, Neil took it really seriously and made sure that this would happen. Uh, that's and look, true. you're all human, it was but a little you don't know what that war horn means. You don't know if that's a fire or if it's a chemical leak or what. Well, it did say, like, you have to exit right now. This is now. all part of Ryan's script, to be honest. <laughs> yeah. They Dude, made it a we little bit later than that, it was expected. Like, all right, what are, horn, like, what are we doing? Like, what are we doing? Shneel, I got a 16. A Jeff rolled a 16. He hits an orc. Uh, D10, D, uh, please. No, D8. D8. D8 plus four. That is a seven. seven. That was a three Seven plus damage to the orc. Right, you slay one of the shirtless orcs in front of you. How many are they? Three more? Two more. Two more right now. Okay. I'm going to cast a spell. What spell are you casting? I'm going to cast hold person trying to not hold Jeff. Tagar. All right. While holding them. They both fail their saving throws and are frozen in place. Me All too? Right. No. Oh. You're good. Nice. nice. Maggie, what like, do you do? I would like to stab them with my short sword. Okay. Stab Am I flanking away. them because I was in the tree behind? Like we mo also, they can they're, they're, they're immobile. You can actually oh. walk up right behind them and get a back attack. Okay, I would love to do that. Yeah. Do Go I get a it. bonus for back attack? You attacks? get triple get, damage on back for attacks. Flanking too? For attack. Plus two to hit for back attack, but they're actually held in place. Yeah, they're not so moving. Go ahead and get plus four to hit. Can't you just yeah, cut yeah. their throat? I like that. Yeah, they're gonna stay uh, there for ten rounds. You're still rounds. in the round of combat, so if you want to go up there and lower your guard and cut your throat, you can. Uh, that's totally legit and can be done. But if there are other people out there and you're just like casually walking up and slitting throats, it's considered your guard is down and incoming missile fire gets a bonus to hit you. So I have, you a, I have a sixteen. Yeah, you can totally do it though. Sixteen. Yeah. Is a hit. Uh, oh. You're. Does okay, she get cool. bonuses so because should be at least an auto crit three, though if they're not yeah, moving. Yeah. And since you're a thief, three times back uh, damage back attack. Doesn't she get bonuses okay. because they're held like five that's five. plus two, three more two two more times. Okay. Five, four, and one is ten. That is enough to run the orc through, and his lifeless body collapses to the ground. There's one more. Yeah. All right. I I just steady and I take aim with a bow and arrow. Do you actually fire? Yeah, I fire. All right, roll to hit. D20 plus whatever's on your character sheet. Uh, Is that a 13? Six. Is that a 10? I don't know. I can't see from here. That is a 10. Okay, that's a 10. 16 against the shirtless frozen in place orc. That's another four for blah, blah, blah. That's a hit. All right. It's actually a crit. What do you know? No, I'm sorry. Where are my where are my manners? Eights, eights. Three and seven, ten. You also Dead. hit an orc in the face with an arrow, and he collapses to the ground. JP, what do you, so would you like is to this, do? Is this last one hold or held? Well, all, no, the three all orcs that are were visible are dead. Oh, so there's nothing in front of me. Is these lovely people. Oh, uh, I just keep walking towards the cave. All right, so you look I'm up gonna, the tree, see the dead orcs. Oh, all right, cool. I'm going to check yeah. if they have any loot on them. She loots the orcs. Coast is clear. We can keep walking. They have this much silver. This is like a Diablo match. I just go right. and pick up all the loot. After. 13. 13 and 7, <laughs> 20. 20 silver. Make sure and mark that down. We're going to spend that in the final <laughs> minutes of the show. I can feel it. Yes. You're going to buy so many things. <laughs> totally getting a magical item out of it that totally. you will be able to All use. All right, we kill him and keep walking. Might need a bargain. Yeah, we keep walking. All right, yeah. you guys keep walking. Uh, it's pretty late at night now. You've been walking for about four hours after you initially cut the poor gnome it's in been half. been four hours? Yeah. Okay. Um, and the, the – well, it's the middle of the night. Are you, how, are you guys walking all night long? Are you going to stop and make camp at some point? What, what are your plans? Do you just keep going? Yeah, I mean, this is a one-shot, so I don't want to rest. Fuck it, all right. Did, did she grab the, the horn? Like, do we have that horn right now? There was no horn on their body. Oh, so it came from afar. 
you can make your own decisions about that. Okay. I am disappointed. JP means his character is very adventurous, so he doesn't want to rest. Yeah, exactly. That's a uh, character, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Good, good. Totally. Cool. So you guys press on until morning, and eventually morning does come. You're still in the forest, but you can kind of see the, the foothills coming up ahead, probably half a day away from you. Okay. Uh, we keep walking. Keep walking. All right. <laughs> we only got two hours to live, Neil. Excellent. You guys keep walking. Um, okay. So another four or five hours pass, and eventually you break into the first set of the foothills that are rising out of this forest. We're um, at the foothills? Yes, you're at the, the start of the foothills as they kind of come out of the forest. The forest only goes a couple miles into the foothills and then kind of just dries off, dries up and dies off. I look on the ground for some kind of pathway or some markings that would indicate that there's a special secret pathway. Uh, you are the ranger. You actually have a tracking ability. Yep, yeah, you do. Yeah, right here. Give me a d20 plus your tracking skill, and let me read for one moment. What is that? It's a six. Damn it. Is that a two? It's a six. Oh no, it's a 19. Definitely a nine. Yeah, it's totally a 19. No, it's a Teen. six. I think it's a 20, guys. What is he looking up? Because with my perception. <laughs> oh, okay, he's looking up tracking rules. So, let's have some small talk. You can't hear me at all, can you? Hey, what's going on over there? Where are you in your campaign? <laughs> oh. oh okay. I like how he turns around. He's like, where? We did not die in a fire. Uh, yeah, that's good. Pretty okay by me. Yep. What was your roll? 19. Total? Oh, uh, uh, no. <laughs> it was yeah. uh, 22. Oh, that's even better. Perfect. All right. So, with the other bonuses for shit on the table, uh, you actually do pick up a path. Uh, it looks like a, a recent trail of between one and six four-legged creatures. Two Between two and six four-legged creatures. All right. I, sheepish, I sheepishly relay this information to the party, and I say, do we want to follow these tracks? Maybe it'll take us to the, the treasure. Could you role-play sheepish, sheepishly relaying this information? Uh, guys, there's some tracks over there. There's like a few uh, like footprints. Uh, like maybe like six legged creatures. If we could go over there, we could. Do you want? Do you want to? Yeah, yes. I keep walking. All right, let's do it. Neil, I will walk start, till you I give start, me something to kill. I start looking doing? at the so. tracks. And We're following, following the them. tracks that she Very good. tracked. All right, you guys pick up the track, the trail, and start following. Um, it's going more or less in the same direction that you guys are, but after about a quarter mile, it turns off and goes to the west for. Uh, another half mile until you meet up with the stream, and then it starts to follow the stream I for a little ways. I start humming a song. Please hum the song. Hum, 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 hum. I'd like someone to hop in. I say that also as I do it. I'm hum. grabbing hum, water hum, out of the hum, stream. Hum. I can't hum. I have tusks. I forgive you for that, but I am resentful for everyone else not hopping on board. I just lip sing it. What? I just lip sing it. <laughs> I notice it. No, I don't notice it. Never mind. <laughs> we follow okay. the tracks. You guys follow these tracks up the creek for a little while. Uh, a few miles turns into a few hours, and wouldn't you know it, the sun starts to go down just about the time that you run into this cave. I mean, you don't quite run into it. You see the cave a half mile ahead, but you also notice that there is a... Uh, a fairly rudimentary watchtower built outside of the cave that stands up above the ground. A watchtower? A watchtower. Is there anyone in it? Yeah, it's half a mile away. You can't tell. Oh, okay. Uh, all right. Yeah, we walk towards the watchtower. Yeah. All right. Wait, she should shoot I'm an arrow to, at it. Yeah, I'm going to fire an arrow Not at it. Not yet. to look at Not it. Not yet. You're half a mile away. When you we can't get reach closer. An arrow. All right. I'm going to wait for the arrow. We could light the fire and use that to... Like oh, put the fire arrow. arrow and, yeah. Fire right. arrow. As we start walking up to it, I use some of my clothes. I rip off some cloth and I wrap it around the head of one of my arrows. Okay. And then we have the flint and steel from this character whose name is... Wombo Combo I totally people. have that. Yeah. Right there. So we make a little fire and then we light the arrow. 
And then we're like, I'm confident that you can do it because you're my best friend. Perfect logic. Flawless. Yes. I, I totally agree. Half of our BFF I can actually have fire her? building as can well. We aid her I lied about that, era? but I have that. No? Okay. No. Excellent. Okay, so as you guys uh, start approaching this watchtower a little bit more, you hear once again the. From oh, here it hey guys, again. that wasn't me again. That I didn't do that. Wait, is it, is it daylight? It is daylight. Oh, okay. It's uh, approaching evening. Do we see anything like riding towards us when we hear that? No. Okay, I keep walking. Excellent. All right, the the war horn sounds at one time, sounds again a second time, and you notice that as you are walking closer to this tower in this cave, you see there's a, a figure cl uh, climbing down the tower. Once it gets to the bottom, it runs in the cave. Huh. I think they spotted us, guys. Uh, it would be at the extreme range, so you'd have a minus five to hit, but you can try. It's at the very, very end of your range. All right. Um, I grab a new, I grab a new arrow, and I try to go for this guy that's running away. I believe in you. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Is that an 18? I can't read. Is it 18? It's yeah, an 18. 18. You can 18. look at them. Look at the stream, Neil. I have to put on my glasses. Oh. Come on, old man, Neil. Yeah. It's actually one. Oh, an 81. Okay. Grand Neil, Excellent. is that you? <laughs> yes, yes. All right, so you get plus six, minus five. 19 is a hit on the back of the orc. Actually, the 19, 20, 21 for back attack. All right, is, do we still have Bless? It's fire. Uh, no, Bless is over. This is not the fire arrow. She got wrapped a different one. She yeah, sped specifically. But 21 is a crit on the orc. So go ahead and give me 2d8 for damage. Seven damage, which is enough to put the orc down. He collapses just in the entrance of the tunnel. Nice. All right, I, I actually start smiling. But when I notice that that Maggie sees me smiling, I just go back to Stone Cold face. Interesting. JP, uh, do you keep walking? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, good. Yeah. You let me know if you can do something different. I will. <laughs> you guys? I'm going to keep walking as all right, well. You all approach. You get to the mouth of the cave. And it uh, looks like it perhaps was once a mine shaft. It's about eight feet wide, six and a half feet tall, kind of looks like a bugger home. Um, and uh, it seems to be fairly dark within. There's no sign of light uh, of any kind. And outside, it is slowly getting darker as the sun sets. Do you have another torch? Yeah, yeah I got one of those. Can you light it? Yeah, I can do that. You should light it. Yeah, I light it. It is lit. Excellent. Well no, done. You're really good at this torch lighting. I hand it off to somebody, though, because I say, uh, I don't need this. I can see in the dark. Who do you hand it to? What? Who do you hand it to? Um, I, I take the torch. Probably JP. Yeah, I take you the torch. You can't use the torch and your sword at the same time, just as a heads up. OK, well, I'll put the two-hander on my back okay, and you, use you the one-hander. You do have a bastard sword. You can use one-handed. Yeah, that's what I use. All right. And nail I walk forward. And you walk forward. Into the cave, yeah. Excellent. All right. You enter the cave. And it, I want to uh, just check while we're walking forward. I want to kind of make sure there's no traps as we're walking forward. Okay, it's going to take a little time to do that, but you can absolutely do it. Okay. What is your detect trap chance? I don't know, actually. I don't think I have one. Five percent. Oh, okay. That's I just easy. walk forward. You detect no traps. Sweet. But the look I on his face is. You walk forward. Yeah. All right, you trigger a trap. Okay. I knew it. See? <laughs> what does it do? Someone walked in front of me. He walked in front. He somehow shouldered his way past your torch. I got eight intelligence. Oh, okay. I'm yeah, good at this. Sure. <laughs> I didn't see the trap. <laughs> uh, a small crossbow quarrel flies towards you and hits you for four damage. All right, so it sticks into me, and I turn to the group and I say, "Yeah, there's uh, there's traps in here." Well, shit, maybe we, could, we should send our thief Wait. forward. Z. Um, no, I it's go, cool, I'm here I got to investigate this. it to see if Z. I can disable it. It's okay. It. Uh, well, it's already fired its load, so. Okay. I'll see the next one coming. <laughs> I keep walking. This one. <laughs> I keep walking. You keep walking. Yeah. All right. <laughs> you keep walking? Do you? Yeah. What kind of trap was it? It was a uh, crossbow trap. Oh, right. Oh, okay. Yeah, totally. We're walking. All right. You guys keep walking. You hear some noises coming from ahead of you, and pretty soon the 
mine shaft opens into a fairly large room. There is a source of light in the center of the room in the shape of a fairly large bonfire. And you look up and you kind of see that there's a, a small tunnel leading out so the smoke doesn't fill up the room. There Guys, are, there's something in there ahead of us. I run from forward. There? From the it, fire. No, from the, like, source that lets the smoke out. No, it's nighttime now. Ah, oh, Neil, Neil, I run forward. You really forward. don't want me to use sun scorch. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Do not it's blame me time. for these things. You guys decide to walk all night long and not fight in the daylight. This is your own fault. I run forward. You run forward? Yeah. Okay. So you approach this room. I never actually got to finish describing the room. So it's Go got the it. fire. It's a fairly large room. There are also eight orcs scattered about in the room, forming Excellent. up in ranks. They have spears and chainmail armor. Some of them have shields. I rip out my sword, my battle hammer, axe, excuse axe. me, and I run forward. Okay. I'm going to uh, hide in the shadows. Okay. It, is there anywhere to like light or to, to use this torch to either like put in the wall or like there a sconce no or anything? Sconce. Is there anything that's flammable? There is a large pile of wood currently on fire in the middle of the room. Oh, so we don't need the torch. No. I throw the torch. The torch is thrown. I, I just I just go. And uh, yeah, pull out my other sword. You should have handed it to her. What? What? All right, so you're you're going sword, you're going axe, you're hiding in shadows, you are... Um, <clears throat> I'm slowly walking forward, following the axe runner. And you are... I just I'm now got your text message, Jamie. I'm <laughs> trying to find someone to blind. <laughs> so you're casting blind? No, I want to cast light on the eyes of the first person I'll see that's not my friend. Okay, cool. So that's my plan right someone now. Someone roll initiative for your party. You can do it this time. And roll better than... Caitlin, roll initiative. What is this, a nine? Don't roll a ten, Caitlin. We believe in you. (laughs) Yay. Nice. Party goes first. (laughs) Nice. Um, Someone go. Uh, We pull in there, and I see that Brooke is looking to cast a spell. And I also received a text message from JP not to die. So... I pull back and hold action. You hold action. I see what happens. Okay. All right. And I'm going to uh, sneak along the sides of the of this room and try to get in a flanking position. Okay. And Wait, is there something I can attack as a wizard? There are like seven or eight orcs standing about. All right, but they don't see us. No, they see you. All right. I just my head up, I just keep walking towards the uh, the brave axe wielder. You just start walking towards an orc? No, Jeff. Oh, Jeff! Oh, okay, cool. And, JP, you are... Uh... And I just have my, are, my did we recover right? HP? No, you've been walking all night long. You specifically said you did not want to rest. Shit. What's her HP? She can heal. My HP is uh, 25. Okay. And these orcs are just staring at us? You guys want initiative, so they're gathering, they're, they're, they're acting, but you guys may decide what you do first. Uh, is that, are we walking in somewhere like, uh, what am I trying to say? Does this open up into a larger room where so the, it's like... It was like an eight foot wide hallway. It opened up into like a 25 foot room with a giant bonfire in the middle of it. And okay. about seven or eight orcs on the other side of the fire forming up ranks. Yeah, I fall back into the hallway. Okay, you, so you fall back in the hallway, you stand your ground, I you cast light. I want to cast light on a dude. Excellent. Any cast particular what? dude or just any old dude? Uh, if one has like a fancy hat, I would go for that one. The Pope is not fancy present. Hat. No, but like one that looks more leaderish, like often they there have There are no cardinals around. Nobody looks more fancy than the others. No. Okay, then random light on an orc. Excellent. While still trying not to be the first one in line to get hit. All right, so you cast light at one of the orc's eyes, um, and the orc starts screaming and babbling about, well, you do speak orc, so you start screaming and babbling about how he can't see anymore, and it's too bright, it's too bright. I'm going to scream, drop your weapons, or else I will blind you all in orcish. Nice. All right. The orcs act. They They held action. She did that. Okay. And uh, now I'm going to chop one's head off. All right. You move forward to attack. Roll to hit, sir. D20, please. It's 
So 20. That was a 14 plus 6, 20? 20. Is a hit. D8. Is it just D8 for uh, everybody? For your axe, it's a D8 plus something. Plus 4. Mine's a D6. 6 damage. The wow. orc that you Should attack uh, falls to your axe. Yeah, sorry about that, buddy. Okay. Margaret, you're flanking. Yeah, you are hey. standing behind Jeff. Um, yeah, well, I'm standing beside him now. And while like staring at one of the orcs in the eyes, I attack one, and I immediately attack the one beside it. Roll the hit. Boom! 10 and 6 is 16. 16 is a hit, just barely. Uh, yeah, but you get your second attack at the end of the round. This is your die. But you're making, oh, okay, right. Two. Not that you guys can see those numbers I'm totally writing down. Totally saw it. This is why I keep a binder normally. I saw it. Shut up, you didn't see it. Um, you shoot the orc, but he does not die. JP, you're backed into the tunnel. Well, he, he ran out and attacked one? Yeah, he did. Oh, okay. I'm just going to go run All out right. and attack one. So you start backing up. You see this guy run forward. Yeah. Ah! Anyway, yeah. Charge in. Actually, not a charge in. Oh, this is an number. interesting die. Oh, that one? You don't need to roll that one. Here, why don't That's you roll this dice. one? Roll it quick. Roll that one. That one's <laughs> better. Roll it. It's JP. been rolled. <laughs> uh, that's a 20. 20 is indeed a hit on the orc in front of you. Just a hit? Just a hit. Uh, where's a D10? Oh, there's another one. This is a D10. I know. Yeah. Is that a 10? That's a 10. That's a 10. So he takes 13 damage. He's dead. You slice him in twain. Great. Do I get a second attack? Next uh, round. Next round. You're okay. real badass. All right. Pretty badass. What's your guy's name? Uh, after the orcs go. Uh, JP. That's my character's name. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So uh, you get two attacks. The first attack starts whenever you go, and the second comes at the end of the round. Then next round you get two attacks. Um, the orcs take their turn. Two of them shift to... Tugar? Tugor? Tugar. 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 Ooh. Uh, natural 19 and a natural 5. 20 is a hit. Your armor class is 16. 16. Uh, no, I'm ready for it. I'm pretty much good to go. No, it's not a critical. Damn it. You take four damage. Marked it. The spear. Nailed it. Nailed it. Um, the other one misses you. And two go for JP as well. Ooh, natural 20 is a hit. Put, put, is, show it. You got to show it better. Is this? Oh, it's not. There you show. go. There we go. Uh, what is your armor class, JP? Uh, 15. 15? Yeah. It clears by 10. He crits you with his spear. You take two damage. <laughs> whoa, 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 oh, whoa, man. whoa, whoa. Roll for sev like severity and shit, though. I don't have my book. Oh, wow. Invent severe. But had effect. I had my book, it would have been 2d4 for severity. If he failed to save. He would have lost his second arm. It would have been eight severity. Roll, on roll location. Uh, probably D20. lost my arm he again. He gets hit so hard, he suffers brain damage and creates a combat shot. Wait, 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 wait. He has to Saber fail step. his Saber save. Step. Uh, hold on, hold on. He did two damage and eight severity. That just, that's dumb. Yeah, if I lose dumb. my arm it's with this. It's a severe two damage. Welcome to games. I didn't make it. Two. In, in the box. There we go. Seven. Seven. Fail. <laughs> Too bad we don't have our book. Otherwise, we would get to see JP dismembered again. You would have lost again. your arm or something. I again. probably lost my arm. Probably lost an at arm or something. At two damage. Yeah, at two damage. Yeah. It's like it a little a scratch, arm. and then your arm just, like, squirts off. And yeah. <laughs> too bad we don't have that book. Yeah. Damn it. I'm pretty happy about this. Well, didn't have enough room in my bag. Um, one, two, three, four. Uh, the last remaining orc in the room that is alive hurls his spear at you. There's a blind one, Neil. Ah, it's yes, that section would be the blind. No, 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 I already accounted for the blind orc. Okay. That blind orc is on the ground rolling around. Uh, he hurls okay. his spear at you and misses. I, I stand there, you know, tall. I flinch a little bit, but I keep standing. You get your second attack right now. All right, and I immediately take fire on him. Do I get a, oh no, still. Never mind. 
Seven and six is 13, is a miss. You hit the, well, you hit him in the in his chainmail armor, which does no damage to him. Let's get an initiative for the whole team. All right. So enroll a d10. Go, Jen, go. Eight for the orcs. One for One, one for Jen. Party goes first. My first attack. I cleave, uh, not cleave, sta uh, just normal attack. Natural 20. Natural 20. He just disappears. Nice. All right, well, we're done for today, guys. <laughs> York drops to the ground. Genevieve? Yeah, uh, I'm going to cast Continual Light on another. On the eyes of another? Yeah. OK, he gets a saving throw against your spell. Pass. Aww. He is not blinded. Is there like a light that's being cast? Still? Yeah, now this room is as bright as normal daylight without the fire. So now it's a normal daylight room with a giant fire in it. Permanently. I scream, beware the fire is not in Orcish. I wanted to do this. All right, Margaret, you have snuck around on the side, kind that's of avoiding Zilf, the most of sir. combat. That's Zilf. Zilf. Margaret, Zilf. your character has snuck around the side of the room trying to avoid combat, and you are now in a flanking slash rear position. All right. I would like to flank them and stab them. Stab away. OK. So I have 14. Plus, do I get anything for flanking? Am um, I getting two for flanking then? Yeah, two for back attack. So 16? 16. 16 is a hit. Um, three times right. damage dice because you got a back attack. He's dead. All right. Just roll it. There's no way you roll less than 10. All My right. God, Margaret. She rolled less than 10. It doesn't seven. matter. He does not have that much life. He drops to the ground as well. Ah! Dice out of here. And they cheer for you. Um, I'm really excited about that. How many are left? Three. I've killed two. He killed one. She killed one. There's a blind one, like, rolling around. That's five. She killed one. I, I killed one, yeah, didn't I? I one. All right, it what is that? three. Okay. I killed one though. Did yeah, I? You did. Yeah, yeah, okay. Keep it going. Yeah. yeah. What do you do? Uh, so how many are left? Three. All right. Once again, I take aim. Whoops. Nope. Nope. This one. Um, this time I use the arrow that's ready to be lit with fire. I have the flint skill too, so I. So you. Okay. If you lean down to light this arrow on fire, you will only get one attack this round. That's fine. Do it. 12 plus, plus six, six 18. is 18 hit. is a hit. Give me a D8 plus one for damage. Yep, that's oh, it. That's... Oh. Dead. It's okay. Yeah. He well, rolled not. a one on his HP anyway. <laughs> JP, do you want to just finish this? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn it. Man, that was an 18, too. Terrible, terrible. Eight. <laughs> Eight plus five, 13. 13 is a miss. Well, it's a clanks into his shield as he rises it. OK. Um, the orcs kind wait, of. Wait, wait, second attack. At the end of the round, end of the round, end of the round. No, 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 we After already had one go, round. The, you guys went first. The orcs get to go, then you get your second sure. attack. Sure. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah. One attacks me, it misses. Go for it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, no, no, no. The, the remaining orcs kind of shriek and. There's like, I'm opportunity. And close together, is like scooting closer together, is and start backing away. No. <laughs> what the hell's going no. on? That's awesome. not orc behavior. Still I'm an attack. Sure it looks like that. You know what? Maybe you should DM tomorrow. Maybe I should. Oh. Yeah. You There'll know. be less fires in the building. Yeah. You can step <laughs> forward. Um, they're kind of funneled down into a narrow corridor, but you can still approach one of them. Yeah. Natural 20. Or two. I was almost there, though. Uh, two's a miss. JP goes for... Is that 20? What is that? A 15. Yeah, so Good 20. Enough. 20 total is a hit. Okay. Just a hit? Just a hit. Where's the D10? There we go. What is that, 8? That's, That's an 8. Eight, eight plus uh, 3, 11. They, they have a maximum of 9 HP, JP. What? They have a maximum of 9 HP. He's dead. Okay, okay. Is there anyone else? Uh, no, there are two more that are backing down the hallway. Okay. Um, yeah, what? like this. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, oh, Zilf was oh behind yeah, them, that, we that weirdness. What? I was Zilf behind was behind them. them. Yeah. 
So if they're backing up into her. Well, okay, so they weren't like a single Wait, follow. Wait, don't I get it? Don't I get holding an eye being like attack because they're backing up into me? She gets no. They she didn't, still okay, gets so attack you get an attack of opportunity when someone changes from threatening you to turning their back to you. You're, they're leaving themselves with an open weakness. So instead of making their attack against you guys, they formed up next to each other with their shields and retreated strategically and but slowly. They they but did they? But did they pass in a? Five meter range of me while doing so. Yes, but without pretty sure they're still backing to up to us. But they had no idea thief. she was there. When someone goes ah and falls forward and there's like a giant sword being ripped out of their back, they kind of figure out that someone got behind them. And yet they back up into that person anyway. But they don't. They don't back <laughs> up into that person. They back up into the hallway next to the person. Uh huh. Are you saying Zilf doesn't get an attack of opportunity? Yeah. You guys didn't get an attack of opportunity. Zilf doesn't wow. get an attack of opportunity. But I, the You're winning. Yeah, I think you deserve the this. We want them back all to die. You me. killed them all. They ran away. Why are you? All right. So we. You move give them an inch, they like take this. a mile. Can we attack again? Uh, they are backing down a hallway. You guys can pursue if you would like, but that is your call to make. All right. I throw my bow to the ground. I bring out my spear and my sword, and I start chasing after them. See your, your best sword? friend yeah. do that. Yeah, I you do you can the do that. same. Cool. <laughs> they go charging. That. Okay. Right, so I do the same. Seeing her do it, I go along. I'm like, charge! All right. All right, Neil. Neil, you got to cliffhang this. I got to cliffhang this? Yep. So Jeff has to go play in his Starcraft right, so tournament. This is what happens. You guys start. The, you drop your bow, grab your spear and sword, charge in. You grab your my war club. hammer. I want my club. You don't have a club. It's written directly right there. <laughs> you do not have a club. It's written on the character sheet. He's, he's and on the second page, there's no club written down in the equipment. <laughs> Why would you do I gotta this? Go, oh. I gotta go you know play, guys, but I will see you okay, tomorrow. <laughs> All right. So you guys charge down at these guys. Uh, just as you reach them, you hear a wave, uh, a roar from behind them, and you see a couple of torches and what looks to be about another 20 orcs uh, reinforcing them from behind. All right. Cliff hung. And no, no, no. We're not making any more actions. Runs. He's gone. He's going to go play StarCraft. I know, but I said, and his character runs the other opposite direction. No, he'll be back tomorrow. Oh, okay. He probably we'll be farts, back tomorrow. Crit farts. All right. All right. We'll figure it out tomorrow. Tomorrow. All right. We'll be like, back well, tomorrow at uh, like eight Pacific, I think. Eight Pacific. And uh, we'll have the whole gang here, and we'll finish out whatever the hell is going on in this campaign. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. That was an awkward wave.